Well, imagine a stately manor tossed in some history, a sprinkle of snow, and the clip clop of horses' hooves. A perfect way to spend time with family at the Hayes Presidential Center in Fremont. Christina Smith has the holiday details this morning. Good morning. Thanks for joining us today. Hi. Thanks for having me, Amanda. I mean, how picturesque is that? Oh my goodness, it's beautiful. Um, you get to take a horse-drawn sleigh ride through President Hay President and Lucy Hayes' uh, estate. Um, the great thing is, even though there's not snow in the forecast, uh, the sleigh rides are offered whether or not there is snow. And one of the coolest things about this, I think, is that President Hayes himself loved to go for rides in sleighs and would ride around the estate in a sleigh himself. How so you're that. Enjoyed. And so we're looking at video here, of course, of those rides and um, there's beautiful snow here. But yeah, well, as you said, not in the forecast, unfortunately, but it's still a great time um, to really get out with the family and then, you know, learn a little bit, too. Yes, um, one of the great things about this is it's fun, but it's also educational. Uh, you get to see the grounds. We're uh, now an official arboretum. You get to learn about uh, presidential history and Ohio history as well. And then you, if you want to go inside, warm up a little bit, you have some tours uh, that families can take over the weekend. Yes, yeah, so our um, Hayes Home Holiday Spirits of Christmas Tours actually start this Saturday. We're offering them for four nights, and um, we are focusing on the writings of Charles Dickens, who was a favorite author of President Hayes and, of course, lived at the same time. So uh, one of those tales we'll be sharing uh, pieces of is um, A Christmas Carol, but we'll also be doing some of Dickens' lesser-known uh, stories. So you'll get to uh, tour the house, uh, see it decorated for Christmas in a historically accurate way, and and uh, hear some Dickens as well. All right, and do, can you just come to that or should you get online and reserve some tickets ahead of time? We recommend getting advanced tickets online at our website at rbhays.org. We will sell tickets the days of the events pending availability. Um, I would say especially for the sleigh rides, those are, are selling out quickly, um, but we do still have some openings right now. So I definitely would recommend advanced tickets for that. There are several trolley ride tickets available and um, our Hayes Home Holiday Tours are also uh, selling well. So definitely recommend those advanced tickets, but if you don't get them in time, give us a call or stop by because we will take walk-ins if we have tickets available. You know, this happens over the weekend through Christmas. Is it through the end of the year or how long is this uh, all going on? Uh, so the sleigh rides are December 26th through 31st. Um, they're that whole week except for Wednesday because we're closed on Wednesdays. And then the Hayes Home Holidays tours are this Saturday and Sunday night. And then they're also uh, December 22nd and December 23rd. So right there before Christmas, how fun is that? And you also, if you want to pop into the museum too, uh, you have the, uh, the train, right? Yes, we have a model train display that we've actually been doing for more than 25 years. People love it. And this year the train display is free. So you can stop on by and check that out. And it's got interactive buttons. Uh, my personal favorite is blowing the train whistle. Um, so there are lots of things to do here during the holiday season. Yeah, and as I mentioned, it just looks so picturesque. It looks very, you know, winter and Christmas. It just, it's all so beautiful. So again, get on the website, get your tickets, reserve your spots. Uh, what's the website again, Christina? Uh, it's rbhaze.org. Easy as that. All right. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thanks for having me. Happy holidays. Same to you. Thank you.